Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Nigel here from Budgeting the Bacon, where I talk about how we save money, earn money, as well as us destroying our mortgage debt. And today is Mortgage Monday. It's actually Sunday night, almost like at 11 o'clock, but we're just gonna say it's Mortgage Monday. I've got my little drink right here to sip on. I've been coloring in some of my sheets and I'm gonna try to make this video as short as possible because I know that you all have other things that you need to do and other videos and other content creators and people that you would like to support also. So I'm gonna try not to make this very long. Basically, wait, hold on. I gotta say, first of all, thank you, thank you, thank you to all of my new subscribers that have come over to my channel from Instagram or you found my channel through YouTube recommendation. I really appreciate you guys. I'm gonna try to be a little bit more consistent on here. I can't guarantee how much, but definitely more consistent what I have been than what I have been the last couple of months to at least try to get out at least one or two videos, especially the Mortgage Monday updates. I do a lot of updates on IG, so I'm gonna try to make sure that I at least stay posted and frequent on here as well, at least to do those for you guys, especially if you don't have um, Instagram. So yeah, speaking of that, if you're not already following me on Instagram, definitely go ahead and follow me at Budgeting the Bacon there on Instagram. I post a little bit more over there, but definitely follow me over there if you would like and if you so desire and choose to. And so for those of you all that are my returning subscribers, thank you all so much. My Bacon Bit Squad could not do this without you guys. And also to the newest members, you guys are part of the Bacon Bit Squad as well. Let me go ahead and get into it. So last one we, I guess, checked off, it was back in June. And the balance was $35,082, no cents. And so basically for the month of July, that was the beginning balance and total that was applied principal payment whether it was what came out as far as what the bank took out and or what i added in additionally it was two thousand two hundred twenty three dollars and thirteen cents making it thirty two thousand eight hundred fifty eight dollars and eighty seven cents i did not take off the cents d i'm so sorry i kept forgetting to do that when i was making the payments this month but i will for sure make sure i do that for the month of august no sense no sense hashtag no sense so yeah that is where we're ending um it would be a little bit lower but i did use some of the money because i am back to school shopping and so i want to make sure that my boys have everything that they need for back to school and then whatever i don't use for back to school as far as you know money that i originally took away it will be applied to the mortgage as normal so down here, I just want to show you guys. So principal payments from for quarter one, January to March 2022, $7,890.99. For quarter two, I think I said quarter two right here. Quarter one, that was quarter one. Quarter two, $7,248. And that was from April to June 2022. And that's principal payments. Quarter three, we're still in that. Obviously, that will be July, August, September. And I'll let you guys know how that goes. So here I've already shaded in the progress just to kind of keep this video a little bit short so it's not too long. But we are now down here where it says July 31st, 2022. And we are up under 33,000, but we couldn't quite make it over here to this next line, but that's okay. We're going we're definitely going to be hitting that at the um, start of August here, which is today when the payment comes out, the original payment comes out, so not even worried about it. But I was able to shade a nice little chunk because I haven't really been shading these in at all. And then also, I was able to color in our mortgage payment tracker or payoff tracker here with the hand that is pouring more of the principal into the houses. Guys, I can't, I think last time I was like up here. And so, yeah, I went on ahead and colored in up to 34 because that is where we are at now. So that means that we're almost finished with this sheet right here because it has 16, excuse me, it has 50 on here and it's $500 each. And so when we finish coloring in, it will be $25,000 in principal payments. Crazy, crazy, crazy. And so then here we have our last tracker, which 
I colored in for June and also July because for some reason I didn't do a, 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 a update for June. I don't think we're coloring it in. But so yeah, this is what we have here. It just shows June where we ended off. It shows July where we ended off. And guys, you see the mistake that I did? I'm gonna have to contact everybody that bought this mortgage tracker, especially if they go out to two years. But guys, you see this for all this? Like, where's the where's the house? Where's the block? <laughs> I didn't even realize it until I was looking at it today. And I'm like, wait a minute, I'm missing something. So I'm gonna have to go back in and actually take care of it and resend a revised copy to everyone and take down off of my Etsy website or what or my Etsy shop the one that I have because clearly we, we need an August I mean I'm gonna write it in but mm, I did not even catch that <laughs> but yeah guys so that is the progress that we have for Mortgage Monday thank you guys so much for the continued support the love that you all are providing to me over on IG as well as here on YouTube. All right guys, if you happen to enjoy this video, feel free to go ahead and give it a like. If you happen to like any of the videos and content that I have, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Make sure you hit that all notification bell so that you don't miss any type of upload. Until the next video guys, bye.